Hi, I'm Sam Farr. Welcome back to Borders Kitchen. Today we're going to be cooking from Around My French Table by Dory Greenspan, which is one of my favorite cookbooks of the year. Uh, she goes through and tells us about her life in Paris and, in, and uh, shares a lot of the recipes that she enjoys cooking for her friends. So today we're going to be doing the recipe swap onion carbonara, and it's called recipe swap because she got the recipe from Michelle Richard through Patricia Wells and through to her. So it's one of those dishes that you make for people and they want the recipe and then they kind of make it their own. So today we, we've uh, prepared some of the things ahead of time. We've uh, made the bacon and one of the nice things about the recipe is you can prepare these things ahead of time. So we've uh, done the bacon crispy and sliced it and then we have some onions with about two pounds of onions which have been sliced and steamed and cooled and then now we're going to pull everything else together which is very quick. So um, from from cooking to table is very quick timing. And we have some cream here and an egg yolk. So I'm just gonna combine those and set them aside for a minute. And that just gets whisked together. And I'm gonna set that aside and start the skillet here. Once the butter's melted, I'm gonna add the bacon. I've used pepper bacon, just gives it a little bit more flavor. This is really a lovely book and I highly recommend it. anybody who's interested in French cooking or the French lifestyle. She has a lot of stories that she shares. Um, I've made the cauliflower soup which was excellent and uh, easy for beginning cooks to advanced cooks. She also shares uh, throughout the book things that she calls bony day. Uh, the point of this whole recipe is to use the onions in place of the, the uh, pasta that's normally in pasta carbonara. Um, but you can take this whole recipe and put it on pasta in the finished dish, which would be really decadent and lovely. But today we're just going to do the general recipe. So that's melting up. I'm going to give it a little bit more time. We're going to add the bacon. So you can make the bacon way ahead of time and set it aside as with the onions so you can prepare that earlier in the day and then just as your guests arrive you can pull this all together and serve it very quickly. She recommends it not as an entree but it really is hearty and lovely as a one pot meal too. So I'm going to turn this up just a bit. And I'm going to add the cream, the first part of the cream. Once that's warmed through, we're going to add the onions. Dory Greenspan wrote another book a long time ago that was one of my favorites. It's called Baking with Julia. And there's some fabulous baking recipes. There's great stories. She's a great storyteller. And now we're going to add the onions. Gonna combine that and then cook through for about two or three minutes. I'm gonna add some salt and pepper here. I'm a fan of pepper, so I add a lot. coming together very nicely. So it just cooks for a couple minutes. I think we're about there. It's all starting to combine. And then I'm going to take it off the heat and put in the, the uh, cream with the egg yolk. So obviously with this amount of cream it is very rich. 
since that's not enough, we're going to add some Parmesan cheese. It's been grated. Stir that all together. best is hot off the skillet. You can get the full recipe on our blog, the Borders Kitchen blog, and I hope you'll try it because it's a fabulous dish. And this is Homer. If you read our Borders Kitchen blog, you will have heard about Homer's arrival in our family, and he loves to be in the kitchen, but you're a good boy.